Oh, it's just like it has less latency, and it's like, oh, that's cool. Like, the, I, I don't know. Switch I don't Pro know controllers are pretty clean. Yes, they feel so natural. They're like one of the best, in my opinion. And like, we're gonna start up Pokemon Stadium. Dose. Pokemon Stadium Two is way better than Pokemon Stadium. <laughs> it is. I don't. I don't care if they are similar or not. That's like Mark versus Lucina. You know who obviously wins that. Yeah, and if we're talking like differences. We noted earlier that um, players start on different parts of the map at yes. Pokemon Stadium. So, Pokemon Stadium 2, the reason why this is legal is in Pokemon Stadium 1, you both start on the uh, platforms, and also the blast zones yep. are smaller. And the platforms are a little bit closer. Um, that can be kind of a preference thing. It doesn't change too much, but um, they are a bit closer. Right, Ooh, and well, both players just commanding the stage well, trying to hold center as much as they can. I just like the fussies between them, honestly. That S-Smash is so fast, too. Um, you see a lot of wolves retreat and use it, try to like bait out options and use it. It's really good. <laughs> and that recovery, <laughs> although exploitable, is mad strong, dude. Wow! That was like... I didn't even expect that. That was so good. And now he's just hopping, trying to bait out more options. I think that's really strong for wolves in general. Just the short hops, the long hops, kind of mix-ups. It's like really neat. I want to see more Blaster and Force Dane to approach. Because that's go. something that... Ooh. Oh, uh, One ton, two ton, three ton, four ton, five ton, six ton. Thank you, Dr. Seuss. Going <laughs> back to the game. Ooh, and I'm surprised that Nair missed. It lowers his platform too, that forward, or lowers his profile. That forward smash is so good. <laughs> I like the laser play from Animal Kingdom as well, like on stage and off stage. Yeah. It just makes sure that Thane can't really get as much of an advantage as he thinks he does. Definitely. I want to see a little more of it though, like I was saying earlier. Ooh, that's a good mix up. Yeah, she is starting to wave bounce with yeah. it too, which is, that's kind of sick. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, I didn't know Dash Tech killed like that. I mean, he was at 8%. It looked like it. I was looking like. <laughs> Alright, but they ain't actually going to go into the juggle options here for Animal Kingdom. Ooh, and trying to catch the, uh, the cross ups with up tilt. Something that you see a lot with Crump. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. And, uh, that was, okay, that was kind of hype. That was kind of hype. <laughs> that was like a DBZ moment where it's like they both like went with their strongest like smash tag. Would Claw meet sword? Would like, Claw meet sword? Claw meet sword. Put that on a movie poster. <laughs> All right. Anyways, up till almost killing Animal Kingdom there, but he's able to land pretty safely, and now we're back into neutral. And he's fishing under that platform. I'd like it. Again, like I said, the laser are actually really good, and he's almost getting stuck. And we Ooh, little player cam action, and we missed the dare. It looked like. Yeah, I could see the dare. Um, he probably caught Crom's recovery at the peak and just sent it to the blast zone. We need to keep the stream PG, you know, because that need to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> what about the children? What about the children? We don't need to see. Look, it's fine if like animals die on the game, but if a human's involved, <laughs> I don't know about that. I, I That's know. when you draw the line. <laughs> Regardless, I think we're gonna run back both characters. Uh, I didn't see the stage. Yeah, I didn't see the stage pick either. But yeah, I think I think both of them have really solid gameplay. It's just a matter of uh, really just who wins the neutral. Mode. Both of them are just kind of footsies. Really. Definitely, definitely. Just, just whoever wins the footsies more. And I, I did not notice that on Hazardless Smash where the platform moves into place first and then stays. It's weird because even after go, it's still moving. So like whoever's on the Oh my right gosh, and Dane getting these strings oh, all the way for 67%. Ooh, that was almost so dirty if he caught him with that. Is that a meteor spike? What's the what official name for Wolf's side special? Is there a name on it? Uh, Tommy Daddy. <laughs> 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 anyway, yeah. Uh, Animal Kingdom actually bring it all the way back, 100% wise, but Zane able to juggle and now got to advantage. So yeah. Nice jump Ooh! back here! That was so clean! That was really, really fast and well executed by Zane. But yeah, Thane, I think he just, I, both these characters are just, and players, just, just that's really just jungle either. Definitely. It's really just back and forth. And the short hop fair into Dancing Blade for a good meaty string. Oh my god, that board size is yeah, so just dug fast. deep with those claws! <laughs> Sitting Thane all the way to Blast Zone, but Thane still with the advantage of oh, the air dodge. Feels bad. That's yeah, a big feels bad. Within these first couple weeks, you are going to see kind of, not a lot of that, but like some of it. Uh, yeah. Just because we're still adjusting to the game, you know, like it's only been out for a week. And when you like scare players off stage, it's something that you see even more. It's like, oh, I used to be able to just air dodge the crap out of this in Smash right. 4 right now. 
especially with characters like Krom, both Krom and Wolf, yeah. will intimidate you at the This forward tilt and its range getting so much mileage. Okay, we just, can we just talk about the yeah. character and both characters can intimidate you? And that's a pretty even game. Oh! Not even taking force smash though. Wait, that was good. That was really good. Really bad for Animal Kingdom, but able to make it on. Was able to get off stage. And now he's gonna look for something he can do to get Thane off stage because he's pretty good at exploding this recovery. <laughs> and he retreats, turns around, and gets the F smash to take that game too. Yeah. Wow. Look at so, you, Mr. Thane. So I actually much a problem. Uh, so was, I feel like Wolf is more just kind of like a power hitter, gets one or two like one or two hit combos and kind of backs off. From what I'm seeing, is he, does he have like really any good combos, or is he really yeah, just kind um, of like? His fair is really reminiscent of Smash 4 Cheeks, where it can string into itself for a good while, especially really? on fastballers or just big profiles. I feel um, like they could work on Krom a lot. Yeah, yeah. Our favorite internet browser. <laughs> oh my god. Krom versus Wolf. <laughs> Waffle. Krom versus Waffle. Alright, here we go. <laughs> uh, game number two, starting off with the top. I like their respective you know? Yeah. Like, Show off these characters like personalities. Look, I did that. Look at look out for the homies, you know? <laughs> Is it, uh, is it 1-1 one, one right now? It is 1-1. One, one. Yeah, okay, wow. Um, Animal Kingdom had that unfortunate SD last game. That's right, okay, that's right. I think it uh, almost buffered his air dodge, and that's why he lost the stock, but I can't be sure. Something that just happened I want to mention as well. Something the biggest adjustment you'll have to kind of get used to is just you can't go past the other person. Definitely. Because even, uh... Thank you so much. Um, because even though Animal Kingdom was on the ground and tumbled, um... Sorry. <laughs> Fane was trying to walk up and probably do something, but it was just dragging Animal Kingdom. So I think I look at the I'm not sure. Did you notice how Fane he jumped in, didn't jump all the way though, so he still had the option to double jump and back air him if he crossed him up? That was so good. And he gets the stock after just holding center stage. Cobb is so strong. He is. Those are some meaty swings, dude. And the fact that he has a sword for range is really solid. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. Yeah, it's Krom's upbeat is something you have to respect so much in this game because not only does it do like a good amount of damage, if it clips you off stage, like you're trapped and it's done. Yes. And something that it has armor, but not as much as like ice up here or something like that. Right. So like that's something like kinda of interesting to know is that you can you can give prop. It's just it's a high risk, high reward. Well see, and I was talking to like Bane and Profanity earlier about Krom. And it's one of those things where it's like even when you're a stock down, if you can just even out the stocks, you always feel like you have this clutch factor. Because if you can string into your up B, it's right. like you just traded stocks, but you you take theirs first. And one of the main columns so are... you never feel too behind, even if you're a stock down. Oh, oh my god! And that's what I'm talking about, dude! Oh my Crumb's, god! Crumb's up B is insane. And I even saw like a lot of people were confirming this, that you can couple fair into up B. And oh, it's, it's, it's a done deal. And the first hit of his nair can combo into F smash too. Oh, he was looking out for it actually. <laughs> yeah. And yet, I see Thane fishing for that a lot. It's a little bit harder on triplats because Ooh, I like that laser. No. Wow, that's so good. Oh my god, and he retreats and does it again, and the top hit of that move doesn't hit him because like I said it lowers his profile and F smash is just so fast. What I really like between these both both these players is that they're doing the same thing but with different characters and for different benefits. Definitely. <laughs> it's really cool. Trying to go for pretty hard read with the other Again with the fours, man. Oh, oh, he's not dead. But he's though. hanging in there. Alright, here's where it gets scary. Krom has a very high advantage. Both of our last stock. Take it. So, MK can make this come Oh, he gets the sweet spot. Wow! That was very intentional. I don't know if he landed at four smash, that was it. But. This is looking really Animal Kingdom close. with the unsafe back air, putting him in a bad situation, but he gets out of it and holds center stage, keeping Dane on these oh! platforms. And the up smash does not take it. Wow, it's still living at 150 compared to the 109 Krom has. Oh my gosh, that's going to be really Krom's close. Krom's tilt is such a good option Stay in so many different scenarios. Animal Kingdom staying in that shield. Oh, oh he's trying to rush it. Not able to quite get it. Does he have a kill throw? I have no, no idea. No, I, I doubt he has a kill throw. Maybe back, back throw, if anything. Gets a jab. Not able to quite get it. Both of them. Holding stage percent. really well. Blaster might. Oh, he had his jump. And he had, and he had an air dodge. Oh! oh! What? 
extending his hurt box with back air and clipping it with the up tilt, Van will take that game three. Wow, that was so close between the players. And Krom's up tilt is, uh, technically Krom is a ec uh, Roy Echo Fighter. So if you think of Roy's up tilt, it's very similar to that in power and quickness. It's just, it's so good to just use as a mix-up, and that's exactly what they use. And it's, yeah, and like, it's just something you have to respect, and especially when you're fighting a character like Rom, you want to bait out those moves, because if you can get in between the intervals of up tilt and forward tilt, you can really find the opening. Tail. Yeah. Okay. Um, Animal Kingdom smiling, though. He's looking pretty confident going into this next game. I, Honestly, I feel like he's adapting I, well and he knows what he has to do to win it. Again, if both these players are doing <laughs> are doing the exact same thing, but for different benefits, and the fact that they're just kind of going back and forth is really fun to watch. Definitely. And I haven't seen much of Wolf in this game yet, and showcasing him so nicely. I like the FD pick. Um, he can't get juggled on these platforms as much as he was that last game. Oh, that's interesting actually. If you're above the ledge and you air dodge down, you get off the ledge. I find that as like an interesting mix up. Yeah, it's definitely useful. Especially for the characters that like struggle mixing up their recovery. Right. Oh my oh, god! Yeah. And he spaced that so perfectly, catching Wolf's side B. I was more always for the damage, that was just so easy. And there he goes again! And he was now off stage. Of course, he's finding himself a little bit more common. <laughs> Alright, for side B. And forward tilt so fast and safe on shield. Especially when he spaces it like that, he can just retreat and keep using it. Oh, I'm trying to intercept that, but Animal Kingdom is very good with that recovery. Always snapping ledge. Animal Kingdom only has 145. Poke, 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 poke. I think that's where Animal Kingdom and just his stocks in general is when he's just kind of in those ledge situations where Fane is so good at mixing up his uh, ledge traps that it just gets Animal Kingdom stock. But Ooh, that was good. whenever Animal Kingdom's on stage... The move looks a little unsafe. Whenever Animal Kingdom's on stage, he's fighting his, fighting his way. Up. Oh, I'm done? I don't think it's... I, I don't... <laughs> Wait. Getting a whole 60% going into that next stock. Uh, Animal Kingdom's looking pretty good this game three. Four, Ooh, game four. Back in four that's not bad. Oh my god, Actually, intercepting. I think he did want to snap the ledge in that. But he has been overshooting the ledge on purpose a lot to mix him up and get that damage. Which is really good as well. He's making sure that Thane has to stay on his toes and guess, you know, how Animal Kingdom is going to recover while he tries to mix up And we're starting, to, we're starting to see use of Blaster a lot more to force those approaches. From oh nice my god. Nice Also, nice Blaster just prevented the, uh, the attack. He made it look like he was going to go for a down air. He jumped back on the stage and gets a quick back out. Uh, and he fastballed no. a little too quickly. I think that was part of this game's buffer mechanic. Oh, yeah, I could definitely see that. But oh, it's facing himself so nicely, getting wow. the F-Smash, but not dying. My back air will do it. Clean back. Bane reacting so nicely to these ledge get-ups. I clicked after the laser. That laser is actually doing wonders right Dude, he's turning this into right a platformer, now. and it's great. But Bane with the juggles actually getting off to the right percent. <laughs> wow. That could have been some really good damage. He's gonna let that F-Smash, but now we're gonna go back to the footsies. Oh my god, it's been oh, there. Oh. Trying to read a rollback. Very smart by Animal Kingdom. Oh, this escapes death. This is so scary for both players, actually. And he's baiting out so many F-Smashes, but he can't get a kill. Alright, getting a little greedy with those uh, F-Smashes. And he's gonna blaster, blaster. Gets in there. Gets another oh, there. That is... That's gonna close it. That is it, yep. So now we have a game five here in Winners. And whoever will uh, win this set will go on to find Spencer the that's from Wisconsin. So, Some game five, both of them just back and forth. What, what's your prediction? What, what, what do you think? Like, I think it's just kind of, I think it's, it's, a, it's a toss up. I think it's really gonna be whoever gets I think Animal Kingdom is gonna get the reverse. It looks like he's adapting very well. But I mean, Bane's fundamentals are just looking so good when he's covering these ledge options so nicely with like back airs and neutral airs. Whoever gets the other player off to use more is gonna be the one who clutches out. Definitely. And going back to platforms, you could tell that's where um, Bane felt most comfortable. 
I like the past combo strings they just did. I don't know what you do, but definitely keep it. And Animal Kingdom <laughs> strings back for his own damage. Like I said, super reminiscent of Smash 4 Sheik's fair. Okay, that's the thing I also cannot get used to is Chrome can actually reverse that. <laughs> it's such a uh, good mix up. Just kind of throw up your foot. Wow. Why is that so powerful? <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh my oh. god. Oh. No horizontal drift on that whatsoever. Going straight into the blast zone. He I probably mean, thought he was closer to the ledge. That's kind of weird. I don't keep him as well because he looks like he wanted to go for something there. Yeah. And so he retreated at the right time because if he went a little bit more outside, he would have got caught by that. Now both. Nice down smash. He was staying off stage. <laughs> no! <laughs> so unfortunate, but now it's a one-stock game. Dane and Animal Kingdom both on their winner's said, final stock. Winner's semi-stock. Wow, but I said I did, they did the same thing. I didn't mean by SD. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, connecting that into the grab for a little more damage. Did he just spot dodge through the multi-jet? I think Animal Kingdom delayed it a bit. Oh, uh, yeah. I feel like that's what it was. But, I mean, it could be. It could be like Samus and Jeff. Ooh, falling with the up air. Alright, here we go. Uh, Thane off stage. Blaster is so good. Position. Here comes the blaster. That might be it. And that's a, oh, oh, no. Magnet hands. hands. And blaster is looking oh so God. good off stage. Ooh, ooh, he wanted the ooh, smash so like, badly. What? What just happened on that top platform? He was just like, going there. Ooh. Oh god, okay, this is gonna come to last hit. I'm sweating for both of these players. I'm trying to fish out, like, kill options with Jeb. Com has such good rage and such good meaty smash attacks. He just, needs, go anywhere. He just needs a forward tilt. He yes, just he does. Or not to, oh, oh, back in, back. and back it will take it. Thane will win that the was, semifinals match in game five. That was such a good mix up because it kind of threw him on the loop where he just didn't know how to deal with that, in my opinion. Like, I think that was just kind of like.